What's up YouTube, it's SVP here, welcome back. Now this is the second day that I got this game, so I prepared and let's play. So I'm gonna just resume for the point that we started before. So that's the second gameplay, part two. Um, and let's go, let's go. So, as I believe I'm inside the spaceship right now. So we have, um, basically, we have to start the mission, which I'm not sure exactly how and where. So yeah, who would know, right? Um, Anyway, it's loading right now up. Spaceship, here we go. It's jumped over, so we got a faster. Oh, so here we go. Nice, let's go to galaxy map. Okay, let me see. So that's the planet progression 12. So let's go to left click this one. And yes, confirm. So I'm not sure exactly. Oh, here we have like weapons. Nice. Not exactly how no mods available, okay. Okay, let's go with this one. Um, confirm loadout. Weapons, then we have this one. Um, okay. Okay. What about the... Um, seems okay, so let's go. Suiting up. Ready, ready, ready. Hope we're all ready. ready. Callow. All right. Integrating search area from Sam. How he pulled that mystery signal through the storms, I have no idea. Multi-sensory neural collision. Amazing. Factory fresh across the board. Spinning up the compensators. You're already tuning the displays. We'll get a better read on this. That's a sun. Nice. People have their hopes pinned on us. They gave up on Eos. Can't okay. blame them. Expected a golden world, instead they saw their friends die. Never know how that'll affect. Sorry. You okay? Let's go. This is exactly why we came. A new galaxy. A new ship. I can't wait to get both a little dirty. Pathfinder, the Tempest checks out. We're good. Okay, so here we go. Take us down. You have no idea how long I've wanted a Pathfinder to say that. So go to the another planet right now. I'm not sure what we're gonna find there. Core is hot. But this seems nice to Shield discover. We got this, right? Oh, a storm again. Clouds and so on. Like every planet have these clouds. Hell. Nice. There. Set us down at this nav point. Okay, seems like there's someone already here. Since they got the packages here. Slowly landing, I get it again. Finally, we can move right now. Not even stop. Reports state this planet suffers deadly storms that are contaminated by radiation from the scourge. EO's deployment was incomplete due to environmental hazards and ultimately hostile encounters. Doors getting emergency power, but it's code locked. Site 1 issued individual security codes. Each outpost self organizes and sets its own protocol. Just say we can't open it without codes. We can't open it without codes. They must have known these wouldn't last in these conditions. If they didn't have a pathfinder. They do this analysis provides us with important research on. data, Pathfinder. If you continue to scan and collect this data, we can utilize it to develop new technologies and upgrades okay. for equipment, such as your weapons and armor. Find the codes to lock. 
took sense log buildings. Okay, I'll try. It's inoperable, Pathfinder. Too long in this environment. Pathfinder, that door is locked. Until power is restored, there is no way to unlock it or gain entry to these buildings. So they have locked the doors, okay. Okay, so somewhere here is supposed to be code, I believe. Oh, here you go. if we need it so we got the code right now let's follow up and unlock the door okay, nice console okay I got a partial log but I can't turn on the antenna Something's blocking the power. A remote lock is active. The interference originates from a nearby power relay tower. Let's check out. Look at this place. It's a wasteland. The radiation in Eos' atmosphere makes it difficult to cultivate life. Radiation? Our suits protect against that, right? Site 1 contains shield masts to dampen the brunt of contaminant. Structure up ahead. Sam? It fits the profile of a power relay station, Pathfinder. Right. We what the heck is this? Maybe buildings get power. And we can hunt that signal down. Huh. Guess that ship wasn't kept then. They don't knock. There are nice. people here. We thought everyone left was gone. Of course you did. Now shove off. Find your own salvage. This spot's taken. I'm not a salvager. I'm a pathfinder. We've come to fix all this. Call me Clancy. Pathfinder, huh? Like that changes much. The Nexus just can't let Eos go, can it? However much it fails down here. I'm tracking a signal that will help Eos. I only need power for the antenna. Look, I cut the power for a reason. The Ket are patrolling today. You turn the power relay back on, they'll know there's a juicy target alive down here. Is it smarter to hide and hope? Or take a chance that might save this whole planet. I remember when people used to talk like that. Okay, I'll enable the generators out there. You want to poke the tiger, it's on you. Expect trouble when we start the generators. There's an error in the startup sequence. Manual input required. Whoa, well, that's a shield as far as I remember. Please scan one of the pylons to determine a hackable input location. Let's go here. Pathfinder, there must be a scannable interface on the power pylon. Really, Ryder? Generator interface possible. Location marked. So we have to scan all of these. Outpost team here? 
No Pathfinder. According to Nexus records, he's stationed in the hangar bay. So he's what? Playing hooky? Or he's a part-time salvager. Nice. We've got company. Station is ready for activation, Pathfinder. Nice. You took down all those cat. Sure, use the power relay. Hell, take whatever you like. Word of advice, though. If that signal of yours is out past the perimeter, you'll need a ride. A ride? Shuttles aren't fun in these winds. You need wheels. I think they kept a little something in storage. I'll take another look around the outpost. Just finding it won't be enough. Hope you're smarter than we were. We're heading to our shuttle. Keep this up. Maybe next time we'll find more than just salvage around here. Don't suppose you've got anything we can use? Okay. No, I'm okay, I'm okay. Nice shield. Radiation levels are severe. Seek safety immediately. Damn, it's inside. Power restored. We should have access to everything in Site 1 now, right Sam? Correct. Plus I've located the source of the signal we detected in orbit. It's coming from the large alien structure just beyond Site 1. The structure appears almost identical to the one your father used to adjust the atmosphere on the previous planet. It's worth investigation. That almost feels like a lead. Damn right it's worth investigating. Here, here. A warning. Radiation levels beyond the perimeter of Site 1 are well above acceptable limits. You cannot proceed without additional protection. All the more reason to see if that alien structure can make a difference to this planet. Come on. We better find that vehicle Clancy mentioned. Now the power is restored, we can investigate the nearby buildings. It's a laboratory, I guess. Well, what do you know? The outpost research center is still intact. Updating the Tempest on this critical recovery. Research was always key to the initiative. We'll need it here, too. This tech is how we survive in Andromeda. Ingenuity on the ground. Someone else agrees. This research center was used recently to monitor the alien signal. This gives us the tools to find the source. And maybe right. whoever else is looking. 
So that's for exchange. Oh, we have take all, okay. Oh, there's the terminal. Okay, let's go. The research station is back online. I've provided a list of weapons we can build by gathering the required. Okay, nice. What the heck should possibly do? Oh, data pad, let's see. Special requisition, all-terrain scout rover. A Nomad, six-wheel drive, jump jets, just what you need. I might be drooling a little bit. This must be so we're actually, actually going to need a vehicle? ...as an access code from a forward station. Forward stations act as emergency resupply checkpoints. Several are currently in orbit. So I have six points. I can call one down. Let's find a good spot. Wow, what's that? Activating automated forward station deployment. Looks like the forward station supplies are intact. Downloading Nomad Crane. Access code. Let's go back. I think we need a code to unlock something. Here we go. Nice. I like how the there's a tracks on the floor when I move. Detecting above normal radiation levels. Radiation levels within acceptable limits. Ah, I can't get traction. It's too steep. Switch to six-wheel drive. 
It'll get you up there in a snap. Damn, what the heck? Yeah, I'm gonna waste a lot of time trying to go up. computer they are not exactly what to expect there It takes so much time to get out. They'll get you over most obstacles. If you need more juice. Got it. Signals coming from that structure up ahead. I'm picking up initiative tech nearby from Above us. I see it. Up on that piece with the scaffolding. It's working, but I'm just getting random symbols. Glyphs. With more glyphs to expand my database from Habitat 7, I could interface fully with the console. And hopefully start up whatever helps the atmosphere. I could provide analysis via the scanner, Pathfinder. Okay, so I need to get up there. Not exactly sure what I'm supposed to do right now. That should complete the glyphs, Pathfinder.
Okay. Building connection. I apologize for any discomfort. The system seems unstable. This would happen when my dad tried doing this? Your father interfaced directly with the atmosphere processor. That proved extremely hazardous. These structures could reveal its control center. System remains unstable. Doubling our power input might accelerate the process. I'll give it a shot. Wait! Back off, or I will push you down! Whoa! Easy. You've come this far. Just let it ride. I've been studying this tech for months. I don't know how you activated those glyphs, but you have to let them cycle through their champ. <sighs> All right, time to get off. Don't like being sat on, huh? I know, I know. Who am I? I mean, it's obvious who you are. I saw the ship swoop in. You're a pathfinder. I was beginning to think the initiative just made you guys up so the rest of us wouldn't lose hope, but... You're for real, huh? Are you for real? You were going to tell me who you are. I might just be the solution to all your problems. Well, look at that. System has stabilized. I'm establishing a connection. Crap. What are they? Later! Just take them out! Keep targeting that one! They make little bots! Whoa, whoa. The Observer and Assembler bots. They're all the remnants of something much bigger. But that's too long. Ugh, I hate long. So, the remnant. Like, my name's better as Peavy. Ryder, you've been studying this... remnant technology? What have you learned? Plenty. Not nearly enough. It's old, it uses glyphs, and it's well protected. I saw this tech clear the skies on Habitat 7. We're hoping it could do the same for Eos. Huh. Atmosphere manipulation? Maybe. Fits the model. All remnant tech is connected. You interfaced with this monolith somehow, and now it's pinging the others. If you wake them up too, they must lead to whatever master switch might fix the radiation. Interface with the monoliths, follow the connection to the source. Easy enough. Sure. Just don't piss off too many observers. Here. Take my nav points. I'll be... I've got to figure this interfacing out. Just be careful. This planet's all kinds of strange. Okay. Imagine leaving all the craziness on the Nexus to be the first settlers here. So much riding on you, and then... This time will be different. Right. This is our element.
damn, this planet is actually cool looking. I'm trying to find the way to the location. Maybe here, yep, that seems like it. Remember the early data on EOS back home? When everywhere was labeled H with a bunch of numbers? <laughs> Your dad put those readings up in his office. Knew them all by heart. Wonder what those worlds really looked like then. And now. Activating automated forward station deployment. Look there. That spot is shelter. Water, stable ground. It was initially overlooked due to heavy kept presence at the nearby remnant structure, but it would be an excellent outpost site. Cat and remnant. Seems you can't find one without the other. So, if we clear the skies, this might be our new home. I think we just have to follow these tracks and it's gonna lead us to the location. The site one folks were interested in the monoliths too. Did he learn anything? Mostly what you learn the hard way. But hey, now you're here. Pathfinder, this area can be mined for resources. You can extract minerals via your mining interface. Radiation levels normal. Watch out! More remnant bots. These ones don't seem hostile. Oh shit, what the heck is the damage? We'll have to scan for the rest of these. Wonder if I'd get anything on the scanner. Some of the pictures are missing. Wonder if they're around here.
Okay, so I have to scan right now some things, but I'm not exactly sure which one. Okay, right. That's like Sudoku. So you have to scan your surroundings. What do we have here? Let's try to go on this one. Maybe we can. Nope, no. Interface successful, Pathfinder. Site one. No one came for her body. We knew some were lost, Ryder. We weren't told they were left. One We have to scan the surroundings. So outside its radiation. Radiation levels have spiked, Pathfinder. Radiation within safe levels. So we have to scan, but I'm still not sure which part. We can't go up there yet, I think. I hate this part when you have to guess what to do in the, in the game. Oh, that was one. Okay, so we need second one. Tech here. Has to help. Then I can see Carrie again. It's 
been a slow start, but we got this. Okay, so that's the second one. Oh no. They were saving any data they could in case it helped the next try. Nice, nice. That did nice. Uh, Whatever that did, I see pathways lighting up all over. The monoliths are resonating. QEC contact? Well, whatever's happening, they're definitely connecting. You did good. Keep doing more. Can't drop shit. Seriously? Can't catch a break. Pathfinder. This area can be mined for resources. You can extract minerals via your mining interface. Okay, so let's fight, right? Okay, seems okay for now. Radiation levels increasing. Ever disobeyed an order, Cora? In my soldier days? No. 
That's kind of the point. It's that mechanical. Never thought about it. Military discipline isn't there to give you something cool to rebel against. In combat, people depend on you being in the place they expect, doing what you're meant to do, or they die. That doesn't mean you're doing the right thing. I know. I have mini computer inside. like a cat facility of some kind. Those assholes took over my best research site. They won't let you near the monolith without a fight.
Nice work. So we need to get around there. Then we need to somehow get to the other um, place. They've got the monoliths well protected. We'll need to cut that shield's power supply. the generation I think that's it okay nice let's get to it before there's any more cat Andromeda Initiative. We're not here to cause trouble. So you say. Still haven't told me who you are. I'm the Pathfinder. Are you now? My name's Scott Ryder. I'm Drac, Clan Backmore. You'll forgive me if I didn't just trust a stranger from the Nexus. They haven't exactly treated us Krogan well. What are you doing out here? Checking out these monoliths? The cats seem pretty interested in this one. Looks like you cleared it out first, though. You said I didn't save any for you? Nexus know shit about the cat. They think they're safe. <laughs> But they're just waiting to die out there in space. I've been quads deep on a couple of planets for a while now. Taking out Ked bases, fighting ground troops. I know what they can do. It's not pretty. You know, we could use a Krogan like you, Drek. I'm flattered, but do you have any idea how many humans I've watched die? Your meat is spoiled. Besides, the day I help the Nexus again is the day the clouds part and the cat keel over. No offense. None taken. Good, because I'm getting bored and the cat are getting stronger. Seem particularly interested in this alien tech. Remnant? Yeah, that. I'm gonna go find more to shoot. Try to keep your head out there. Again, again. I think we need more glyphs. Wonder if I'd get anything on the scanner. Looks like we're missing something. Again, again. Okay, so here we need to go. I 
experiencing radiation damage. Radiation within safe levels. Um, that's a bit more complex than before. So I have two of them. One is here and one is here. Let's go to here. Oh, here it is. Radiation levels have spiked, Pathfinder. Radiation within safe levels. Yikes. Let's go one more time. So we're gonna go back to the car and then we're gonna follow the pod that we're supposed to go. God damn it, son. Oh damn, I can just disable the shield there, oh damn. Instead, I went <laughs> over to the other side. So let me see what's down there. Well, let's take some risk. Detecting above normal radiation levels. So I need to get to the center of the event that would be there. Earth had formations like this. Made a lot of kids think of alien worlds. Water and weather. Nothing tougher in the long run. Coming through! Anyway, I guess that's not the right way to get there. Let's go around because I'm not exactly sure how to access this point. You left, you left, you left, right, left. So you can talk the talk. Now walk it.
Oh, here's the bridge. Nice work. So left card there because it's not that important. Radiation within sync. Nice. Right. All that fanfare for an empty room? There's some secret here. There must be. Do your Pathfinder thing. Nice. Oh, you're good. I didn't do a thing. How far down do you think it goes? Electrostatic? Ah, uh, gravitation. Oh, you idiot, PB. That wasn't the front door. This is. I'll let you know. Hey! <laughs> nice. Gravitational shield. That seems so cool and so on. Anything could be important. Let's be thorough. Only minimal power. I don't think it triggered the atmosphere processor, but a conduit beneath the floor just activated. Fluid is running through it. It could be generating emergency power. Your scanner will have more details. Nice, this is like ultra automatic spaceship. This door should be working. Damn, it shows you where to go right? with G. Okay, nice. Do we need a password? I see the conduit, Sam. Whatever it is, it leads out of the room. What about these holographic patterns? Can you scan one? I think that gravity well works in reverse, too. Then we have a way out. You're not leaving already, are you? Not until we find those processor controls. Let's go forward. These data pattern things are incredible. If I'm right, each one can hold hundreds of zettabytes. There are whole species who get by with less. Minor corruption detected. The pattern suggests significant data present, but it cannot be accessed. They sold some patterns, I guess. Oh. You can. That'll get their attention. 
Lucky me. So now that's interesting. Not what we're looking for, but worth getting a record. You go ahead. I've got your back. Phrase recovered. Must read to access. This console links to surface facilities. Then it must control the atmosphere processor. Glyphs. It looks dead, or locked down, like most of this place. The fluid conduit oh. leads to this console and further into the vault. So if we follow that conduit, it might lead to the system lockdown. Uh huh. What have we here? Open. We read it. We get access. I think there are more multiple of them. Shouldn't it be warm on this deep underground? Nope, not here. Ah, here's the rocket kick down here. Safe and sound. Scratching the surface. Oh, that was it. Well, nice. Another gravity well, and that's new. What is it? Symbol of authority? A key? It's easy to speculate with Remnant, but we need more facts. I'll see what I can find on this beauty. Maybe over this way. Whatever has this place on lockdown is that way. I do my best work solo. You fix up the vault, I'll investigate the relic, and together we'll figure this place out. Not a bad idea. We'll cover twice the ground. See? I knew you were smart. I'm on frequency 145.8. Stay safe. Right. Ten credits say she ends up in a pit of spikes. Gravity will seal off. No way through. Incidentally, a gravity well, then well the damage is the gravitational oh, effect of a large mass in space. This is more accurately a well with variable gravity. Keep a note for our sorry friend. And for when we try to explain all this. Com check. It's... well, you know who. We read you, PB. Stay in touch. They dug this place through solid rock. Look up there. Sun. Must be how they kept it from collapsing. Whoa. What's that liquid? Unable to classify. The only way through is down towards it. Ah, watch yourself. Burn. Remnant! What the heck is this gun? Holy, that's all under the planet.
Watch the edges. Way ahead of you. That seems like Highland Van Stevens or something. Look how high it is. Might be another gravity well. The well's sealed. Damn. Maybe we can use the conduit for emergency power, same as before. Better stay from starting. Take them out. Look how high it is. Might be another gravity well. that same
well sealed. Damn. Maybe we can use the conduit for emergency power. I could provide analysis via the scanner, Pathfinder. Interfacing may complete the circuit and allow the world to open. If it gets us to the system lockdown, let's try. The gravity well remains in lockdown. The device is online and makes a shield. At least it's friendly. Layers and layers of defenses. If they're defenses. Nice. Third pressure is variable. There could be activity below. Then let's dig deeper. Hardly any dust. How old is this place? Unknown. Radiation counts indicate the vault has been offline for several hundred years. Right. Around the time the scourge appeared? That can't be a coincidence. Maybe the scourge is why all this tech was abandoned. Crap, the conduit sprang a leak. Careful. No way you can interface with the console like that. And no fluid means no power. Damn it. Maybe that's why those devices up above were turned off. We're not turning back now. There has to be some way to fix the leak. Dead. Without the conduit, there's not even enough power for the door. Ryder! Up here! What happened? Work. The conduit's breached. Hey, wait! The observers were using weird laser frequencies to pick the broken wall back there. I can send the frequencies to your Omni tool. Maybe they can patch up the conduit? And received. I'll give them a shot. <laughs> the system's responding to those frequencies. Just a patch job, but it should hold. Sunlight, no water. They should all be dead. 
The source of the system lockdown may yield more information. We appear to be close. Observers coming up at us! Armor hydraulics compensating.
Right, right, right. Two gravity wells down already, and this place goes even deeper. What's at the bottom? Let's not find out the hard way. Damn it. Any thoughts, Sam? Uh, no. Though it appears related to the lockdown, an in-depth study may reveal its purpose. The system lockdown is disabled. The vault and the atmosphere processor should return to full operation. Ryder, you fixed the lockdown, didn't you? The whole place is lighting up. Power readings are off the chart. Really, really off the chart. But if it's back online, we should be good. Okay guys, so that's gonna end here. So thank you for watching. I just say in case Oh it doesn't need to okay so yeah that's actually it guys for this um, part. See you next time.